The main goal for the co-location data center was an environmentally sustainable facility. So really taking a look at the energy we spend at today's data centers, understanding that power is only going to go up. Um, one of the core missions of this design was to uh, achieve as, a, a, as an efficient as possible facility while still maintaining standards. And the co-location data center still is going to have to adhere to ASHRAE standards. It's going to have various different types of customers with standard computing type of equipment, some legacy maybe even. So um, it's important to keep that in mind when we're talking about the energy and the design details of this facility. We were still kind of struggling in the design with what do you do with the customer that has this traditional storage, front to back cooling, um, storage arrays, uh, you know, we know all the manufacturers, uh, they typically don't always come out of their enclosures because we void warranties and things of that nature. So in order to, to mitigate that, uh, we work with Chatsworth in developing what we call the POT, so performance optimized data center, and you see it here behind us is basically what we designed is, a, is an 8x8 pot, but the configuration is flexible. It can be any type of system, so we run front to back type of equipment in these pots where they're accessible from the front and accessible for the back, and they have a central, again, passive heat rejection into the common return plenum. I would probably also like to point out in this facility is the ability and the flexibility to work with Chatsworth to customize our environment. So, you know, that's something that we looked at various manufacturers um, around the United States on and we just couldn't make it happen. We were under a time crunch here. This entire, this, the entire construction was performed in six months, start to finish. We're at a 30,000 square foot facility. Huge amount of construction activity came on in six months and the ability to work with Chatsworth to really, we wanted this to be a showpiece. You know, when you when you get into uh, things like LEED and, and do all these environmentally conscious things, you want it to be a showcase facility. You know, at times we had 150 plus workers here in the facility, all being in each other's way, obviously. So staggering these guys in, a, in an area that is so rich of and complex of technology like a data center made it very difficult. So the ability for us to work with Chatsworth to land these products here at the time where we needed them and exactly then so we could get our electrical crews out of the way, get these things out of the ceiling, then land our cabinets, then land our pots and start to design and coordinate that with flooring and all the other trades that needed to come through. Um, it was, was uh, really, really well done and, uh, and, and really contributed to the success of the overall construction here.